So welcome to this series on getting set up with hosting. Now, hosting can be a real pain to get set up, um, particularly managing your hosting and also scaling your hosting if you need to. Now, you might have found yourself in the position where, for example, you're unable to update your PHP version or you're not able to go into your server and update PHP settings. And this can be really annoying. So in this series, we're going to be walking through pretty much everything you need to know to get your hosting set up on DigitalOcean. And DigitalOcean is a really great way to host with very little cost, little time and little effort. And what you'll have by the end of this series is a server that you can fully manage, uh, you can upload to, you can access with a domain name. So we're going to be looking at attaching a domain to our server. And we'll be covering all of this so you're literally ready to go. Now, if you're a little bit worried about not using a hosting service like GoDaddy or any other solution that basically sets everything up for you, uh, you don't need to worry either. So DigitalOcean has made it really easy to get everything you need installed and working. So that includes Apache, PHP, MySQL, and obviously the operating system you're running on. So something like uh, Linux. Now there will be a slight learning curve, so it might take you a little longer, but trust me, it will save you a lot of time in the future by hosting this way. So for example, if you need to go ahead and update your PHP version, you can jump right into your server and update it yourself, or you can go ahead and install additional services you might need. And if by the end of the series, you're still stuck with anything, uh, DigitalOcean has this amazing community with loads of tutorials uh, to learn stuff and they also have a forum where you can ask questions as well. Just so you know, this video has been created uh, literally from a pure love of DigitalOcean. It's nothing to do with an affiliation. We're not being paid to promote DigitalOcean, but it really is uh, a great service and a great community. So it's purely just a recommendation. So for everything you need to get set up, let's head over to the next video where we'll be creating a DigitalOcean droplet. Oh, and before you do that, make sure you go ahead and sign up for a DigitalOcean account.